when I go to come here, I just can't get past his knee, all right? And none of this trickery is, is working. We're gonna now go into what's called a high tripod, which is from here, I'm gonna drop, and then smush into here, okay? And now we have essentially what's, what I know is a dope mount, where I have my shin pinning his bottom leg, my hip covering the top leg, all right? This is a, a really bad spot, worse than the other one, because at least here, you know, there's a chance for him to turtle. Here, it's a lot trickier because his hip is stuck on mine. Good ground and pound position here, right? And I could also look to gift wrap and advance to taking the back, all sorts of fun stuff, all right? So again, it starts with the same setup. I push, circle. Now what's gonna happen when I see I'm beat, I'm gonna drop my head into his ribs right here, all right? I'm using the crown of my head. My hands that were on the knees are gonna slide down, whoop, like this. This arm, the blade of the forearm, is gonna go inside the hip crease, all right? This arm is gonna hold the top of the knee. And here, boom, on my feet. Now, what's happening with this arm is that it's gonna push. And you see, by pushing, it turns his hips away from me. Right? As long as the hips are pointed towards me, his guard's gonna be active. When I start pointing it away, now his guard is over here, all right? At the same time, this hand's gonna guide and lift that knee as I push it out of the way. So I'm here, I start pushing and I circle towards the legs. So now I bunch the legs up and I'm gonna have one leg in between, hips on top, okay? Right from here, there's a lot of options depending on what you wanna do. Again, for MMA, this is a good enough position to start ground and pounding here, boom. If I see an arm blocking, I could catch the arm, boom, go into a gift wrap. Now I'm in a much better position to strike. You know, chances are if you get this, he's probably gonna try to turtle to unwind it. Boom, and now we're right into the back. And I'm gonna start attacking here, looking for chokes. All right. So again, here, boom, drop, circle, bunch the legs up. If you want it to be really simple, I could just step out here, get side mount, right? If you like wrestling and cradles, I could get a cradle right here, right? And you could use this to also advance into the back too, right? Like I said, lots of options, but for right now, I just wanna focus on getting into that dope mount, all right? So I pivot off, drop my head into his ribs, hands, boom, drop here, circle as they push the legs away, boom. Make sure bottom leg is pinned with my shin, hips on top. Any questions? Let's do it on three. Ready? One, two, three. Hoop. Thank you for tuning in. If you enjoyed the video, make sure you like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell. That way you'll be alerted when the next video drops. Now, if you want to get more videos like this on a daily basis, go and visit my membership site at ffacoach.com. We have online video curriculums, our daily videos, and you can get bonus courses like the Kimura Trap System for free when you enroll today. So go ahead and help support the channel and visit today.